Right then, so we're going to have a look at uh, uh, at what child is this to start off our um, Christmas program and this should be really easy for you to pick up because we it's the tune of green sleeves so we have sung this in the past but for, for those of you who haven't sung it uh, certainly the upper voices have got the tune and the lower voices really it's a very simple harmony that goes with it okay so the words are what child is this who laid to rest on Mary's lap is sleeping, whom angels greet with anthems sweet, while shepherds watch are keeping. That's our first verse. And then I'll and then the chorus. This, this is Christ the King, whom shepherds guard and angels sing. Haste, haste to bring him Lord, the babe, the son of Mary. Okay? So um that's all all fits into the, the tune of Greensleeve. So I'll sing it to you. Uh, just the first verse so you can see how the words fit. What child is this who laid to rest on Mary's lap is sleeping? Whom angels greet with anthems sweet while shepherds watch are keeping. So just watch. Um, the th on the first uh, little section there, Mary's lap is sleeping, we've got a D natural, and then at the end we've got a D sharp, okay, and, an, and a C sharp as well, but we don't have any Cs uh, prior to that. Okay, so then here's your chorus. This, this is Christ the King, whom shepherds God and angels sing. Okay, so again we've got that D sharp coming in at the end but it's a familiar tune so we know how it how it works okay so maybe you can go back and sing that through with me um, and um, let's have a look very quickly to see how the words fit for the upper voices for the verse 2 and 3 um, so basically we just go back and repeat all of that apart from when we get to the end of the um the end of the last chorus we go into a little coda at the end and it but for the upper voices nothing changes you just basically repeat um babe the son of mary okay that's all you do so um verse two goes like this why lies he in such mean estate where rocks and ass are feeding? Good Christian feel for sin is here, the silent word is bleeding. This, this is Christ the King, whom shepherds God. And then we go back to the last one, last verse. Let's try that together. There's your note. So bring him incense, gold and myrrh. Come peasant king to own him. The king of kings salvation brings. Let loving hearts him
in and that's literally what happens in the top voice so it's really really easy and straightforward okay um, we, we could just make sure that um, you've got enough breath to sing through the phrases um, ideally you're going to sing through the whole of the first um, sentence in one verse in the first verse um, but if you can't you can breathe before the word on okay um, and before where and before come in the other verses and then and then again um, obviously you breathe after sleeping feeding and own him um, and again, again if you need to uh, breathe after sweet here and brings in verse one two and three at, um, if you need to otherwise breathe, sing through the whole of that phrase which would be fantastic if you can but I know it's quite a long phrase um, okay, and then in the, and then in the chorus, when you see a um, comma after king, you can you can breathe there, uh, breathe after sing, breathe after Lord, and then again, obviously at the end. So that should be quite straightforward. Right, let's have a look now at the lower voice part. So um, you can either sing this um, as written, or you can sing it. Um, or you can sing it an octave up, but I think for 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 male or female voices, at least tenors, you you should be able to sing sing these um, as written. Okay, uh, uh, so it just it goes down to an E, but it it should be fine. So let's um, let's have a look at this. So we, you're going to sing, child is this, and you hold it, and the S only comes on on at the end of that as you hit the um, um, as you hit the best okay not any time before angels greet while shepherds while hot are keeping and then the rest of it kind of follows in the same kind of pattern lies in mean estate Christian fear the silent word is pleading and etc. Okay, so let me sing that through for you. The, here's your note So you're there. This is the note that's written and it goes like this Child is this Angels greet while shepherds watch our keeping Okay, so that's that's the tune for the harmony. Let's look at it with the other um, verses before we go into the chorus. So, lies and lies in mean estate. Christian fear, the silent word is pleading. Okay, that's the second verse. And the third, there's your note, and incense, gold, and myrrh. King of kings, let loving hearts enthrone him. Okay, watch out when you have um, words like incense. So you make sure that this is kept to the tiniest little fraction possible, okay? So we don't have lots of um, uh, sounds, okay? Incense. You see? So you hold the hold the vowels rather than the, the uh, consonants every time. Okay, let's look at the tune for your chorus. So it goes like this. It's not hugely different, certainly by the time you get to the end of the chorus, but this is how it starts. So you're there, and this, this is Christ the King, Christ the King. Haste, haste to bring him, Lord, the babe, the son of Mary. And you do that every time, obviously, because it's the chorus. However, when you sing the very, very last bit in the coda, 
you've got this lovely G sharp, which kind of brings us, turns it all around at the end into a nice major chord. So you're going to sing, Babe, the son of Mary. Okay, so just be aware of that note at the end. Okay, so that's that one for now. And let's quickly look at um, something new, Sweet Charming Bells. <laughs> 